The new Springboard website has been designed to reduce waste and offer members more access to information. Now, members can sign up for site visits, create and view site visit evaluations, and download narratives and budgets all from the website. This video will walk you through some key tasks. The strength of Springboard has always been its members. I hope you use the website and find the features helpful to your important work. Let's begin. I'm going to go ahead and sign in as a test member. So this will be the experience that every member should have. My test member landing page is for members only. This section here will provide you with pertinent information that may be changed as new information arrives. The attachments will also change from time to time and provide you with important current information. From this section, I may go ahead and edit my account, either by clicking Edit. This will provide me with changing my password. I may also update my member information, such as my name or preferred phone number, also the year I joined. This is helpful if you're looking up teams and like to make sure that your information listed here is correct. So let's begin by signing up for a site visit. I click on the site visit calendar and here I will see the upcoming grantee evaluations. I may go ahead and find out more information by selecting the scheduled or the proposed visit. This will bring up more information on that particular grantee. I may also go ahead and click on the grantee URL to, to get more information. So let's say I am able to attend the Beyond the Ball evaluation. I can click on attend here. If I can also drive, I will select that I can also drive. Since I'm going to attend this grantee, now the color of that grantee has changed, indicating that I'm going to attend the evaluation. If I'm unable to do so, I simply click on that link and click I can't attend. This will remove me from that attend list. Once I've made my selection, I would like I may be able to view some view information and gather information about that grantee. I can do that by going to Applications and View New Grantee Applications. Here's a summary view, which I may sort by name of organization or application year. Let's go find out more about Beyond the Ball. Here is the grantee detailed view information summary. I have information that came from the application, summary of request, some high level information about the the grantee, some financials, as well as all the information that they have provided during the application. I may go ahead and click on these links to download that information or to pull it up in a view. On this screen is, are also my driving directions to the grantee. In order to see a larger map, I may click on this print larger map and it will give me a detailed map and the driving directions. Going back, I may also change my starting point. So let's say I'm not going to start from a default driving point, but another location. So I put in my from address here, click on get directions. It changes my map and the view. Again, if I want to get and updates my driving direction. Again, if I want to print a larger map, the updated map and driving directions are listed here. After we're done with grantee value grantee visits, I may you may have the ability you have the ability to create grantee evaluation. Go to applications, create grantee evaluation select the grantee and provide information here. I hope this high-level overview of the new features of the Springboard Foundation website have been helpful. Thanks for watching.